Hey guys, it's Lam here again, your tech guide. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are going to be doing a follow up on the Rinky Bessel styling that I installed a couple of weeks ago. So we're going to see how this thing will perform when we actually splash with water or, or submerge it underwater. Just, uh, you know, just to give an idea how durable this, um, this Bessel styling on your watch for. For example, if you are going to wash your hands or wash dishes or go for a shower or a, or a swim, this whole video will help you guys out if this vessel styling will stay on the watch for screen display. So I just want to let you guys know that uh, my watch 4 does have the screen, uh, the screen protector on it. So basically the rinky vessel styling is on top of the screen protector. So without further ado guys, let's do this test and find out what the outcome will be. So here we go. This is it. As you can see, there's the best styling. It looks amazing on the watch for silver um, color. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to put it under the water or first we're going to splash a few drops or so and see how it performs. I'm going to remove the watch band first so that it doesn't get damaged. So we're gonna do a few splashes to replicate that we are washing our hands or are uh, doing the dishes. As you can see, the water just slides off to the sides, to the side, nothing to it. It's not causing any damage, okay? Take a look at that. Okay, so still intact. We could even move the bezel styling to see if there's any movement. So, so far the double-sided adhesive tape is doing what it's supposed to do to stick on the screen display. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna place it underwater. So, let's uh, put my timer here. We're gonna probably set it up to I don't know. One minute. One minute. Oh. <laughs> okay, guys. I just activated Alexa. Alexa, stop timer. One minute. Okay. So here we go. I'm gonna drop it and place it, and when we'll follow up. Oh, hold on here. What happened to my timer? All right. Off it goes. We're gonna see where this watch or the double-sided adhesive tape will do for us when we got it underwater. Hopefully it will stay on and do what it's supposed to do. On the description, it doesn't stay that um, this adhesive tape is waterproof or anything like that. So cross our finger that it is so that folks like you guys out there who are looking for reviews or i mean um you know answers this video will be the one for you guys we'll do one minute first and uh, see where it's at before we go for a full five minutes okay here we go stop timer and see where we at here Shoot, I put too much water. All right. So take a look, close up. Water all over the place. Now we're gonna try to move the vessel around here. See if we have any movement whatsoever. And it looks like it is still intact on the screen protector, guys. So when I installed this, I didn't uh, actually use an alcohol wipe to wipe the surface of the screen display. I just uh, basically wiped it down with a cloth. So technically, if you really want this adhesive tape 
to stick on the screen display or a screen protector, you definitely want to use an alcohol wipe to make sure that it will really stick on the surface. But so far right now, it is doing a fantastic job. I don't see any movement whatsoever, guys. So let's continue and finish the five minute mark and then we'll wrap it up. I could even probably put the timer here. That's no, okay. Here we go. Resume. All right, guys, so it's five minutes now. We're gonna check it out. But before we do that, I'm gonna try to uh, imitate the movement if you are actually swimming. And uh, hopefully uh, we could uh, loosen this adhesive tape as the best as we can. If not, that would be excellent, guys. So I'm just gonna spin around here, wiggle, wiggle. Okay. And I think for we're almost there. One minute. All right, so here we go, guys. So again, just wanna let you guys know that we do have a film screen protector on this as well. So we are, I think I did a test on this already when I merge it under water and it uh, would held itself. And now we are doing the vessel styling. So here we go, guys, as you can see, we're gonna try to move the vessel around just to see if we notice any movement at all after placing this under water for five minutes. Let me take a closer look here in an eye level view. And it looks like there is no movement whatsoever, guys. So the adhesive double tape is doing a fantastic job, guys. And now you guys don't really have to worry about having this uh, soaking wet if you guys are taking a shower or washing the dishes or perhaps go for a swim. Okay, so again, if you guys are interested in this product, uh, the Rinky Vessel and the Screen Protector, I'll put a link in the description below. And if you guys have other questions or requests or video tests, you want me to do uh, regarding the watches just leave me a comment down below and once again guys thank you for watching my video until then i'll see you guys on the next one peace